Hello kids, last year Petaluma Pete did a video to show your adults what happened when Santa came to town on a riverboat. As a special consideration to the Downtown Association, here is that video again so you can show your adults what to expect this year. Come downtown on Saturday, November 27 at 11 o'clock. It was a month before Christmas, when all through the town, the kids were all stirring, and nowhere a frown. The street signs were hung on the light posts with care, in the hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. The children were coming to see Santa deliver his holiday message by boat on the river. Peddler Pete played holiday tunes from afar, while visions of Christmas tips danced in his jar. When out on the water there rose such a clatter, we sprang from our perch to see what was the matter. Away to the river we flew like a flash, where people were gathered for this annual bash. The sun on the surface of the D Street drawbridge gave a memorable view of the scene for the kids. When what to our wondering eyes should appear but a cool river boat without any reindeer, with a little old leader so lively and quick. We knew in a moment it must be St. Nick. More rapid than eagles the big boat it came, and on deck were partiers, and he called them by name. Meanwhile the holiday tunes came from Pete, for kids only who laughed while they danced in the street. The big boat was docking, and Santa came hence, while kids on the shoreline were pressed to the fence. You'd think it was Star Wars or Miley instead or Elvis, or Jackson, back from the dead. But no, it was Santa, the ultimate dude. It's the media maven to whom we elude. And then in a twinkling we heard on the ramp the prancing and pawing of each foot in his camp. The children were screaming, and as we turned round, up the last steps, St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur from his feet to his shirt and his clothes were all tarnished from riverboat dirt. The kids were now desperate. As their adults held them high, they pressed forward for photo ops and mobbed the poor guy. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples, how merry. His cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the beard of his chin was as white as the snow. Mrs. Claus was there with him, watching his back, and fun chamber members were carrying his sack. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. He was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf, and we laughed when we saw him in spite of ourselves. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head soon gave us to know we had nothing to dread. The kids were now singing their carols so high, it brought peace to the city and a tear to the eye. All right, everybody, now here we go. And as we were nearing the end of this flight, we wondered if we might hear St. Nick recite those five little words we've all learned to say that Petaluma kids repeat in so many ways. And as he was leaving, we heard him say boldly, <laughs> This is for children only. <laughs> Thank you, Santa. That's close enough. 